hi guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video okay mm. anyway today's video is going to be another hair review video and also chit chatting about something very important when it comes to friendships okay if you guys want to see this lovely new wig i want to show you and also hear my thoughts on friendships in general then please keep on watching <laughs> Alright guys, so let's get into this hair review. This hair I'm going to be talking about today is from Love Me Hair, okay? Love Me Hair. And I love, love, love this box that this hair came in. It looks so pretty. So, 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 so cute. Now this wig is definitely straight out the box. I haven't opened it. I haven't looked at it. It is straight out the box. So I'm just trying to like open it up and see what it looks like. I love their packaging. They have this purple themed packaging going on and I absolutely love it okay so there is a little pouch here um, in this pouch oh I love it it's so nice um, okay they are press on nails here a nude set of press on nails um, we also have oh earrings guys there are these cute hoop earrings oh I love it then there's a hair scrunchie really nice hair scrunchie it's not finished though, there's still more. Then there is a phone. Um, what do you guys call this thing that you pull at the back of your phones? Really, really cute. I love it. It has like this mini mouse thing going on, but yeah, it's a phone holder. That thing you put at the back, a phone ring, right? All right, that's all that is in the pouch. Then in the box, there's also a pair. No, not a pair, two pairs of lashes different styles so cute and it's a brand name that's on the pack love me soap so pretty I love this then there's also this wide um, double-sided wide toothed comb there's a pamphlet inside the box just info about the hair and all of that and then we have the hair proper it came in this really cute purple pouch and yeah let's look at this mm. Mm. I'm loving it already guys like I am loving it already. Right, so this is what the hair looks like. This is a natural, short, coily fringe wing. I think that fringes are like coming back into fashion right now, guys. But it is a short, coily um, fringe wig, as you can see. And this is like straight out the box, guys. This is a straight out the box kind of wig. This is a wig that you wear and you go you guys know me i don't have energy i don't have strength for laying your front house and all those things i hardly ever do it so i'm usually happy when i get a wig that i can easily just wear and go it is so 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 convenient no glue needed it's not a frontal wig it's not a closure wig so no glue needed and might i also add that with this you protect your edges because we all know what glue is doing to our edges these days so this for this wig you don't need any glue protect your edges all right and it's also very easy to take off i cannot wait to put this wig on so let's get into that As with all wigs it has combs inside to secure your wig down on your head and it has a very nice elastic band I love that so let's get to wearing this wig guys Okay, so I just used like my afro comb to comb out this coils a bit and I am loving it guys. I am loving this hair. I cannot even lie. It's giving me like a different vibe. It's giving me like a 70s vibe that I absolutely love. I love going back in time. Like I love it so much. I don't have anything like this in my stash. So this is definitely right up my alley. I'm going to just apply a bit of leave-in conditioner and see how this hair takes the product and all of that i love this because for this hair you don't need heat you don't need a uh, hair wax and all those things that we need to do to get all our straight hairs to look really good you don't need all of that i feel like with this you just need some product and an afro comb and you're good to go I'm just going to comb it out again
I love that this hair is full. It's full and it's very, very bouncy and it's lightweight. It doesn't really feel heavy at all. I absolutely love this and I feel like this is about to become my everyday hair. Like everyday pop and go. I love it so, so much. Again, this wig is from Love Me Hair just in case you are interested. All the information that you need will be right down in the description box below. So look out for that. All right, guys. So let's talk about friendships just a little tiny bit, okay? Let us talk about friendships. Um, I have people always ask me every now and again, or people always assume that I don't have many friends. Um, I don't have many close friends because I don't show you guys a lot of friends here on YouTube or even on my Instagram and all of that. And um, I'm going to just give you guys a little bit of a background history into my life and friendships. I've always been that girl whose best friend always has a best friend. Do you get what I mean? And I'm talking like right from primary school. I had a best friend in primary school that I thought was my best friend. I mean, she was my best friend, okay? But this my best friend had her own best friend. And she would tell other people that, all other classmates that this person is my best friend. And I would always be the third wheel in a best friend kind of relationship. I don't know if you guys get what I mean. And I feel like that has always been the case for me, like right from primary school, even down to secondary school. Um, I usually would, you know, get close to someone and say, okay, this person is really my friend, my best friend and everything. But it always turns out that whoever it is that I am best friending in my head has another closer friend than I am to the person. Even down to university, guys, even down to university, I'll get close to somebody and feel, oh, she's nice. Oh, we can really be really good friends. And then, you know, we hang out a lot. We do everything together and everything. And I feel in my head, oh, this person is my best friend. But like that person has another best friend. It is what it is. It has always been a case of me um, I don't know what's the word now. I don't want to say begging for friendship, but a case of me just declaring best friendship on someone and then they have their own friends. Like that has always been the case for me. Even down to my adult life, I feel like I have had somebody that I know, oh, I'm so close to you. In fact, you're my best friend. But in retrospect, that person has their own best friend, you know? So definitely for me, friendships have not always been, um, I don't know how to put it. In my entire life, I've not really had like a best friend. You know, some people have best friends from when they are children down to when they are adults, that person is their best friend. That's not me. Alma has not had that uh, luxury, okay? My best friends always have their own best friends. And trust me, it is not a funny situation to be in because at the end of the day, Sometimes you feel stupid. I don't know how to put it. Yes, sometimes you feel stupid that, you know, you thought somebody was your best friend and all of that. So when girls have their friends, oh my God, this is my best friend. That has not always been me. When I got married, my chief bridesmaid was my sister. I feel like when it comes to being close to people or calling somebody my best friend, I have two best friends, my sister and my mother. That's it. <laughs> my sister and my mother. Any other person that you see, you know, me with or hanging out with me most times are acquaintances turn up acquaintances or you know maybe just like a group of hangout buddies or a group of friends when it comes to close friends best friends it's just like it's not just my thing i don't know i just gave up on that concept of best friendship a long time ago trust me there are days there are days when i crave to have a best friend you know have that one person that you are always with that one person that when they see you you've, they've seen that person you get but it has just never been my thing it has just never been for me really right now at this point in my life i have friends i have more of acquaintances okay and i feel like acquaintances in turn will turn to friends at some point in time i mean you meet people today they become just a hangout buddy or an acquaintance and then in a couple of months you guys are you know getting closer you guys become friends and you guys can even become sisters from there so i feel like at this point in my life and i think i mentioned this in my 30s video my leveling up in your 30s video i feel like your 30s are that time in your life where you're going to make new friends and friends that will last you your entire life and if i do say so myself I think I am at that point in my life where I am getting to know people more, um, meeting new people, getting to know them 
and hanging out with them more and who knows tomorrow these people can become close friends and in turn become sisters as well and i look forward to that but in the meantime i'm just i'm just soloing myself okay i'm just soloing my friendship if that makes any sense so yeah that is my take on friendships i don't take friendships so seriously if they come they come if um, the person is amazing the person is good to me i am i know that i am a fantastic friend i can be a fantastic friend to somebody and i have been fantastic friends with people all my life but i feel like sometimes you know i need to get what i'm giving back in a friendship um, it can't, I can't be giving you everything, giving you my all in a friendship and you are dashing it to another person. Do you get my point? I feel like it's a tip for that thing. So that is literally it. All right, guys. So that is my take on friendships. Um, let me know in the comment section below what you think about friendships, how friendships have been for you in your life. Are you also in the same boat as me that... Yeah, best friend always have another best friend. That can be very awkward, but let me know in the comments section below. Um, once again, this hair I rocked today is from Love Me Hair. Every info you need will be in the description box below. <laughs> okay guys hope you guys enjoyed watching this video if you enjoyed watching let me know in the comments section down below subscribe share thumbs up i'll see you guys in my next <laughs> video Mwah. bye